Hey all, welcome to my channel, welcome to my world, it's the world away, and I do understand some of you have started to get your deliveries through from Hashit for the Terminator. I finally managed to get hold of part 57 of Hashit Partworks, Build the Terminator. Now, because my news agency is closed while we're all in this uh, coronavirus pandemic and uh, a lot of the shops are closed at the moment, I've had to get this one off of eBay. Uh, so when my news agents eventually does open, I'm going to have to get them to send them back. Uh, but a lot of people have asked me, uh, they really wish they had got on board with this when it first came out. Well, if you still want to get hold of the Terminator, you can do that by going over to the Agora Models website and you can get that from there. And I do believe they post worldwide. So uh, if you want this in America or Australia, uh, you can get hold of this. So uh, that's brilliant news, uh, but there's not much to do in this issue. Let me show you. What we're going to be doing is finishing the right hip joint here. And all we've got, we've got the uh, a hip plate there, uh, and then we've got a, a right leg part. And that's pretty much it. We are going to need an Allen key for this one. We have used this Allen key before. We're going to need that to tighten the one screw that we've got to put in in this issue. That's it. There's going to be no glue, so it's going to be a really quick issue. So turning it over, as you can see, we're going to be putting that uh, plate on over there, the cap, the joint cap, uh, and then we're going to be securing that in with the one screw and the Allen key, which just shows you there. Then we're going to be put these two pieces of the uh, a leg part, that's what they're calling it, together. They said that this is a really tight fit, so it's not going to need any glue. Uh, and that's it. <laughs> that's all we've got to do in that issue. Uh, in the next issue, you're going to fit more parts to the right thigh. So we've got this part here. I do believe this part here is plastic as well, just so you know. A lot of people do ask me, and I know some of the people have got issue 58 already now. I'm a little bit behind on that, so I'm a little bit tardy, so sorry about that. So without further ado, let's get cracking. So as you can see, I've got quite a few angles of the Terminator now. We've got the top camera here. I've got a side camera close up here. I've got the side camera over here, which is sort of like a big landscape view of it. And I've got another close up camera just here showing this part here. So hopefully uh, you'll be able to see every single thing we're doing. Uh, but what we are doing first is we're going to be putting this plate over the top of this area here that we fitted last time uh, just to hide all the uh, gumps and stuff in there. So that looks just like that when that's in. And that's going to be tightened up with one of the Allen key screws. Now they do make a note in the instructions there to say don't over tighten this. It's meant to have some play. So I'm going to do it hand tight to start off with. Let's get this Allen key in. And roll it round. And as soon as it's tight, or it starts to bite tight, I'm going to keep it going. <laughs> Keeps going. Keeps going. There we go, it's getting tight now. I'm just going to make it one half turn like that. And it should still make the wig move around. It does stiffen it up a bit, but I think that's ample, sort of like play in the leg to make that be able to move on that pivot there. Don't tighten that up too much. If you do, you're not going to be able to move the leg here. And that's all there is to do with just that hip plate. So let's put Termi back down here for a second. And then we'll bring over this leg part here. Now, both of these leg details here look absolutely impressive in the chrome, but they are plastic, uh, just to let you know that. Uh, and this is just going to go into the end. And they did say it's a tight fit, so I'm going to push it hard. Push it down like this. Make sure it's all the way in. And there we go. That's the leg piece done. And guess what? That's all there was to do in that issue. So I've been waiting ages for that. Finally get it through. And we do uh, uh, an issue there which has taken, oh, looking at my frame right here, five minutes. And when I cut that down, that's probably about three minutes. So tomorrow, we're going to be having the Spitfire. On Saturday, we're going to have pack three of the Agora model Shelby. And let me think, on Sunday, I think we're doing the Ferrari F40 Stage 7. So uh, stay tuned to this channel. I'm getting videos out every single day uh, just to keep you happy, keep you sane while we're all locked up in our houses and not allowed to go out. Anyway, listen, I hope you are keeping safe and I hope you like that video. If you did, please remember to give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed already, please remember to subscribe. Other than that, take care.